Okay, hello, hi everybody. Very well. How's everybody doing? Uh, thank you guys. Thanks everybody for watching. I really appreciate it. I really do. And um, we we're watching today. Today we we're watching Lupin episode nine of season one. And uh, in the last episode, Claire and him broke up. And the return of Juliet, who he tries to play in order to get to the father, and it works. Father has been arrested, but the plan was to leave her behind, ditch Juliet afterwards. She could not do that; he couldn't do it. He does. He, he does have a heart after all, and he couldn't bring himself to just um, betray her like that, just drop her. So, turns out that he has a heart. Uh, he has a heart, and he's no way he could. He's no way he was gonna drop. He wasn't just gonna ditch her like that. So cruel, uh, especially you know after what she had done to him before. She wasn't about to. He wasn't about to do it back to her. But I was thinking about that, and I think that it's gonna get, it's gonna end up haunting him. Or it's gonna end up coming back to bite him in the ass, so to speak, because, um, see, this is like this is like triangle between Juliet and uh, Claire, but Claire, I think, always loved him for him. Well, not love. It, it just she cared about him, and there was no string attached to someone else. I think that Juliet always chose her father over him. That's that's what it shows. And the, when they were children, and he had asked her to come out to see him, and they were going to meet at the bridge, and he never did because the father said, "I forbid you from 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 seeing that guy for you know why, you know what reasons," and um, she did it because dad said so. She was always, she's always little daddy's little girl or whatever. She was very, well, she was very obedient to her father, and. <clears throat> Um, she she did this against her father for him, but what what happens when she finds out that he was using her to get that? I don't know. I, I feel like it's I feel like it's gonna blow up in his face in the end, though, because ultimately she is loyal to her father over everything. I think, and I think that it's not gonna work out for very long. I think he's meant to be with Claire, and um. I think he's gonna get. I want. I, I want him to get back with Claire. I want him to get back with Claire. So I think he will eventually. I think that their this relationship is kind of poisonous, and it can only last for so long because I don't think he really loves her. And I think ultimately she will. She's still on the dad's side and will always shoot the dad over him. Um, that's my piece. Let's get to Lupin episode nine. Let's do this. Ouch! All part of the plan. Monsieur. Don't tell me that's clear. I mean, don't tell me that's Julia. Le type a fini par lâcher. <laughs> bah, euh, bonne journée. <laughs> bonne journée, Lucas. <laughs> What's that about? Oh, Fontan, ministre de l'Intérieur. Oh shit! Sure. He's flexing his power. Ça va pas On paraît sorti de garde à vue. Mm -hmm. Qu'est-ce que tu veux faire, Hassan hey, Calme-toi. Pour la fondation, pour ses enfants, pour leur avenir. Tu vas pas les abandonner. Mm. Je suis désolé, il faut que j'apprenne à ça. Vas-y. Fabienne Berriot est enterrée à Lille. J'ai appelé la morgue, faisant passer pour un parent qui voulait payer l'enterrement. Et moi, c'est pas gratuit. Ouais, je ne lui connais pas d'amis. Oh, une shit. société domiciliée à Saint-Ouen, un antiquaire opus. No. Oh non! Benjamin Ferrel. No. Le type est spécialisé dans les pierres précieuses. Il faut aller voir le frère. C'est la preuve. Parfait, faisons ça. Je vais mettre en place un dispositif. Non, non, non. Où est ce Léonard va s'en occuper. Hassan Diop, c'est son affaire. Il a deux gars, monsieur. Il ferme la porte. Qu'est-ce qui se passe là? C'est une chatouille. C'est une chatouille. Qu'est-ce qui se passe Trail Il hum, recommence. Ah. Bah, arrête de prononcer son nom. Ah, si. ah, il sert de dog. L'autre jour, hein. Il est grignifié. Je pensais qu'il savait. Il a aboyé. Come on. Ouais, il a aboyé. <laughs> Come on. <gasps> oh non. Ce gars est bon. Ce gars est bon. Donc, il est venu après toi. Il n'y a pas d'escape. C'est presque fini, je t'assure. Ouais, mais tu dis tout le temps ça. <laughs> mais non. Tu vas pas te mettre à me parler comme ta mère. Elle est à côté, c'est ça Non, c'est moi qui te dis ça, papa. Pense. 
C'est pas parce qu'on veut faire tomber Pellegrini qu'on doit empêcher Juliette de faire une bonne action. Oui, mais ouais, c'est c'est ça. Ça. Ça Pellegrini, 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 Pellegrini Allez, bonne chance, hein <rire> There's no way. This has gotta be a trick, right? There's no way he just walked in like that. That's that's Pascal. He was taken out. He was taken out by his own people. Oui, je crois qu'il y a une bagarre entre le 12 bis avenue Trudens. Ça a l'air assez violent. Vous voyez, what's he gonna make of this? Hopefully, he figured it out already. Yep. L'homme le plus recherché de France ce soir. Ah, ça ne rappelle-moi tout de suite, s'il te plaît. Oh, it's him again. It's a uh, shit. Uh, Dumont. Hey, reste avec nous, Gadira. T'es pas au courant Quoi Faut que tu quittes la boutique, Benjamin. On est grillé. Prends tes affaires et tire-toi vite. Go, 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 go. Ok, alors te retourne pas. It's him. It's him. Et surtout reste discret. It's him. Garde ton calme. Ne cours pas, ne panique pas. No, you're being, they're not being discreet. Ben, il est parti. Non. Tais-toi sur l'assassin. Holy shit. J'avais un Mais t'inquiète pas. Il fera rien ici. Et juste avant que le bus redémarre et que les portes se referment, tu descends. Oh shit. Maintenant. Oh shit. Je sais. Oh shit. Oh. Attends, t'es garé. Maintenant. <laughs> oh, yes, it's a lie. Oh, shit, what was that? That was freaking cool. Non, mais sérieux, Gedjara. Depuis le début, t'avais raison. Tu saurais que le mec qu'on cherche, ça peut pas être Arsène Lupin. Pourquoi tu dis ça? Arsène Lupin ne tue pas. There you go. C'est un gentleman cambrioleur. Bah, Diop, lui, il est. He's right, though. He's always right. He knows this guy better than anyone. I mean. de job c'est sûr mais il est où ce type vous a forcément laissé un indice quelque part je crois que j'ai trouvé quelque chose qu'est ce que tu fais je commente l'actualité mais arrête faut qu'on quitte paris là police il a réussi toujours à s'enfuir They have no idea who they're dealing with. Putain, Holy bien. shit! Wow! So they made this spot on one of the tunnels or something. Holy crap! No way, did he send a message to him or something? No. He knows it. Because oh, he cracks codes. Oh, so cool! The two didn't have a relationship, man. His fellow partner in crime. He, had, he was looking at that thing. There's like a whole different world down here, man. Thinking we're into a different show. <laughs> it's a crypt, right? Yeah, it's a crypt. Look at the tour. Est-ce que vous avez vu un homme grand, noir, cheveux courts, probablement armé? Vous voulez dire Hassan Diop? As above, so below, man. The horror movie. I think that's the same place, isn't it? They have the map. They know the hidden. They know the hidden tunnels. Oh my gosh. Oh. oh, they missed it! Holy shit, they missed it. Whew. And where did it lead? Oh my gosh, it's just. It's to a whole other part of the city. Tenez, madame. Comme promis. He held on to it all this time. Alors, dites-moi. Preuves qui pourraient remonter jusqu'à nous sont en lieu sûr, il ne reste plus qu'à les détruire. Bien. C'est quoi ça he, he has all kinds of backup shit. Égal... Mes hommes se posent de plus en plus de questions. Ils se rapprochent, je le sens. What is it Oh shit, he has something, he has the stuff on him. 
Oh my gosh, you're gonna, you're gonna be able to describe him. Du monde. La seule chose que vous avez à faire, c'est d'aller au concert. I, I saw her, but you, ba you felt bad for what happened to him. Don't do this to the kid. Don't do this to him. Tu sais, comme 1911, au théâtre du Châtelet, ils ont joué la première adaptation d'Arsène Lupin. Ah bon? Oh boy. Ce sera la dernière. On va en finir avec Pellegrini. Oh my god, this is exciting. That's the police station, is it? What, what, what is that? Oh my gosh. Alright, so that was Lupin episode 9. The, uh, Asan, 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 Dup. Dup? Dup. Something like that. Dup. 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 <laughs> Something like that, right? I hope I'm getting it right. Uh, so, Pellegrin got out of, got out of um, uh, police custody. No big surprise there. He was too powerful to be kept for very long. He's not going to go down that easily. He's, as we've seen time and time again, he's way too powerful. Too many people. He knows too many people. He knows the freaking minister of the interior, minister, minister of the interior. He knows everybody. And he's not going to go be able to go down that easily. He's going to take a little more. You're going to have to get your hands a bit dirty to get this guy. Now, okay, so he got out, but... At the same time, they also happen to find where he lives, and oh, I was so afraid they were gonna be able to take out Ben, but no, Ben Benjamin is okay, thankfully, and they were able to escape from the clutches of the hitman. Who, interesting enough, they didn't kill. He, they could have let him. He might have actually might have actually done it. Managed to get to um, Asan Asan, but um, instead they killed him, and they used him to frame Dup Dup for murder. So they don't really want to kill him. I think they want. I think it's not enough to kill him. They need him to go down. I don't know. Wait. Well, I guess they need him to go down for the murders at this point. Or is there something? I, I still think there's something else going on there. But that he wants him for some other reason. But maybe I'm maybe I'm reading too much into it. Either way, he's now trying to. He's now um, been framed for murder, and this works in his. It works in the guy's favor because now they can put all of it on him. I think. Whatever charges he's been accused of and everything will be ignored real, real quickly once this happens. Diop was um, Diop and uh, Ben had to go on the run. That was an awesome scene at the bus stop where Ben had to sit next to the freaking killer. Uh, Pascal, I believe his name is. He's still out there. Uh, Pedro? Pascal? Something like that. He's still out there. Uh, they managed to get away from him for now, but we're probably not, we're probably not in the last of him. And the two of them uh, escaped. He also managed to send a message to Gudara. Gudara, Gudara, Gudara. Um, about uh the uh oh proof. He's he had some he had, he had a bunch of leverage all saved up and packed away, and he saved like a it looks like a memory card or something or like a USB drive. He saved one in like a wax in the candle, and by sending a message to to Gudara, he knew he would get it. He he knew he would get. Awesome. That I like that he basically now I mean uh um he basically has someone in the police force he can count on now. <sighs> and because they had and, and it's all connected because they share their they love their their their, their love of uh they share a love of Lupin. Lupin Lupin <clears throat> anyway, uh it's it's really cool. It's, I like the relationship. So uh they managed to work together they managed to um they managed to figure out figure he now has evidence on Dumont. Their chief of police or whatever. Holy shit, that's gonna change things. What is he gonna do with that? I don't know. But I'm hoping that he now sees how deep the rabbit hole goes, and he can't even trust his own people anymore. I hope that that becomes the case. But he might have just made his. He might have just made Gidera a um a a a um. He might have just made him uh a a target now. But I'm hoping he's got a plan for that too. It ends with the two of them. Sitting on top of that, that's something about the talking about the, the chateau or something, chateau or some, some kind of a theater, I guess. They had they, they, they did a 1911, they did the first play of Lupin, and now it's their turn to do a show. And they said, This is gonna be the last show, we, this is gonna be our last show, our final show, and we're gonna take Pellegrin off for good this time. So, I guess this whole all the so I guess their plans have all been laid out, and so far, everything is still going according to some kind of plan, it seems. And now the final, the final step that he's been planning ever since he was a child. It seems. I think that's what he was doing ever since he was a kid, because the whole tunnel thing was planned from back then as well. 
shows that he's been planning this his whole life to take down this guy. And now he has it all laid down, ready to go. And I think that the reason why there's so many, there's always auto work in his place, is it because he uses that to sell in case he needs money? I don't know. It, it seems like all of his hideouts have artwork in it. He just has that much artwork everywhere. Uh, but okay, I guess. Um, but that is Lupin episode nine. I can't wait to find out how. What what what, what is their last show going to be? What is their final? What is their final move going to be? That's going to take down Pelican for good. And it's going to apparently it's going to happen there. I'll see you guys there in the next episode.